guys, it's Mackenzie, and today I'm here to share with you the 100th anniversary of ANW. So to celebrate, we are going to be sharing with you some of our favorite ANW root beer floats. <laughs> to make a classic root beer float. So all you'll need is A&W root beer, vanilla ice cream, and a frozen glass. So first I'm going to start off by taking three scoops of vanilla ice cream. Now just top off all of that delicious ice cream with some creamy A&W root beer. Now put your spoon in, and your straw, and enjoy! Welcome to the 60s, Woodstock, Watergate, and Punk Rock. Today we're going to be making another a w root beer float. So today's is s'mores, and you'll need your a w root beer, your Rocky Road ice cream, but the recipe recommends s'mores, but we're just using Rocky Road and your classic ingredients for s'mores. Graham crackers, chocolate chips, and toasted marshmallows. So let's start. First I'm taking my chilled glass and I'm just gonna put in three scoops of ice cream. Next up, we're going to add the A&W root beer. Now it's time to decorate the root beer float with your graham cracker ingredients. Now finally I'm going to add my two marshmallows and Welcome to the 70s, the age of disco. So today we are going to be making a salted caramel root beer float. You will need A&W root beer, caramel, sea salt, and a salted caramel ice cream. So first I'm going to add three scoops of salted caramel ice cream. Next, I'm going to add my A&W root beer. Now I'm going to take my small spoon and dip it into the caramel and just drizzle it over the top. Finally, we add a pinch of sea salt, and here we go. Welcome to the 80s, starring MTV, Footloose, and Heavy Metal. Today we are going to be making a brownie root beer flow, and as always you will need your a w root beer brownies, maraschino cherries, chocolate sauce, whipped cream, and plain vanilla ice cream. So first I'm going to start off with my cold glass and add three scoops of ice cream, some brownies in between each layer. So 
from A and W Root Beer. Whipped cream. Our cherry. And last but not least, chocolate sauce. Mmm, that looks delicious. Let me get a straw. As well as a straw. enjoyed this video and if you did leave a like and comment down below what is your favorite A&W root beer recipe. For more information on these recipes go to rootbeer.com. While you're there take the pledge to go technology free for one hour on every Friday and you will get a coupon for a free two liter root beer float. Bye!